So today is 3-23-23. Do you know what that means? Did you know that the number 23 is all about transformation and change, as this year has already shown that it is? But today, in particular, 3-23-23 is all about manifestation. So let's go through three basics, A, B, and C, of how to manifest correctly. I'm putting this video out because I see too many people here on TikTok making it sound like you just tell the universe what you want and it brings it to you on a silver platter. That's not what happens. And that's not all you have to do. That brings me to this first point. A, the first thing that you need to do in manifesting is change your words. Yes, that sounds really easy, but it's harder than you think. We are conditioned to say things like, I can't, I won't, I don't, I never. Now you're in that mindset. So when you shift your words to, I have, I do, I am, present tense, as in you already have these things, you shift the way you think. Now this flows into other areas too. I never win anything. And that Debbie Downer aspect, you can't have that anymore. Meaning, yes, you have to put in the work to retrain your mouth to not say the bad shit. That brings us to B, the second part of this. And that is harder than the first part. And that is retraining your brain. Now, I touched on this a little bit with A, but when you redo your wording, when you shift what you say, you shift how you think, you shift your mindset, I know people laugh at all of the gurus and me and other people that say, if you just change your mindset, you'll change your whole life. They're not wrong. They're not wrong. By shifting your mindset, by shifting your words, instead of being this down in the dumps, nothing good ever happens to me type of thing, suddenly, not only does your vibration and the frequency of your body change physically, Everything around you will change as far as your vibe goes, as far as your life goes, as far as everything that happens around you goes. This brings us to see that third part there. And it's really not easy either, but it is at the same time. Don't you love that? You actually have to do some work to show the universe that you really want these things. You cannot just write on a piece of paper and put it down and put it in a book somewhere for 20 years and go... Oh, the universe is bringing this to me and then sit on your ass. That's not the way it works. You actually have to put in some work to bring that manifestation to you. Follow me for more manifestation tips.